most of the information that you get about um, how to conduct yourself is in WeChat groups, which is like a WhatsApp uh, here in China. And there are different uh, groups of people um, in, you know, depending on the interest, yes. different groups going on. So there's a lot of information there. Um, yesterday, the um, Foreign Affairs uh, Office in China issued uh, telephone numbers for foreigners who what 24-hour uh, possibility to reach them. Right. If you were looking for advice or you wanted to consult them on anything, and for the Chinese people, it's um, in, in the Chinese media, and, and sometimes there's a loudspeaker which will basically it's saying the same about wash your hands, wear a face mask. Uh, uh, and are you cough. are you confined to your homes at the moment? Yes. And, and and relying on social media, and if you've got the languages, then loudspeakers driving up and down outside. What, what, what under the current reading of the situation, how long do you have to stay under sort of self-imposed house arrest? Well, it's it's not. I don't. It's not been announced when it's going to end. Um, certainly, till the end of Chinese uh, spring holiday for Chinese yes. New Year um, on the third of February. Um, uh, factories and workplaces open up again, but that's that has been extended already to the third of February. It should have opened sooner. Yes. And um, schools, I think, till the seventeenth of February. That's an extended holiday. And it depends on, I think, how the virus will develop. Is how, you know when when you will be given the okay to go out again. Are you scared? <laughs> I have been scared, but the, uh, I think it, the, it's not actually. I, I'm not, I don't think it's that contagious. Actually, if if you stay in and sure. if you actually do go out and you're not in the crowd, um, and and you're careful what you touch. Um, then you know it's a low risk. Like for example, if you, I mean, there's so many flats here. I mean, I live on the 21st floor. If I go down, I um, got to press the ground floor button. Yes. And then I, I don't do it with my finger. I do that with plastic gloves on. Sure. Which I throw away afterwards. Gosh. Um, because everybody touches that, and it's transmitted partially by touching the same thing so you you're particularly conscious of, of where you place your hands i understand that and, and what if you wanted to get out altogether i mean obviously you can't at the moment and if i've understood you correctly you have no really clear idea of when you would be able to leave the country not just leave your flat well yeah the the, the whole whole town is on lockdown which means there's no buses there's no metro um there's a few taxis How, what do you do for food um, Supermarkets are open. You can walk, if you can walk there. But if you're not within walk, if you're not within walking distance of a supermarket, or, 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 or you're not very good at riding bicycles, you've got a bit of a problem. You'd be relying on family, would you? Or? Yeah. You you would, or you'd be setting off early, walking walking there. And and if you now um, were to go downstairs and and start wandering around the streets, what would happen to you then? Are you you you'd be rapidly encouraged to get back indoors, would you? Or no, actually, I, I did go out today. Right. Um, this is the first time for about four days I've been out, Gosh. and I, I went for a small walk in the park, and it was very nice to have the wind on your face. I can imagine. <laughs> was it busy? And, uh, was it busy? Were uh, there many people out? No, it wasn't busy at all, but there were other people out. There were a few Chinese people exercising, stretching yes. in the park, and uh, just going for a small walk. It's an overused but, uh, word. Mid- and normally it's very busy. Right, you are. Um, it's an overused word, but it, it, uh, presumably surreal would fit the current. It is. Yes. It is. It is surreal. It's the, the buildings are there, but there's the, when it, first, the, it was first imposed, there was very few people on the streets, and it, the buildings stood, but the population had gone. And, and if you see these large flats, it's full of people just all inside, just waiting to see what's going to develop.